hello guys welcome to another video and today we are going to be looking at the windows 11 clipboard manager so if you don't know what a clipboard manager is it's a software that allows you to save the history of everything you have copied so technically when you copy something it comes to override what was already there previously so a clipboard manager is going to help you save the history of all the things you have copied so that you can always return to them when once you need something you had copied previously so it's very useful it really boosts your productivity and so windows 11 comes with a clipboard manager already and so it's quite easy to access that clipboard manager so assuming you've already activated it in your settings you have to go to your settings and activate that feature so you're going to go ahead into your settings settings and you want to search for clipboard manager clipboard settings is good enough and here you are going to see clipboard history you want to make sure that is turned on so once it's turned on now you're going to have the feature to enable you're going to be able to enable your clipboard manager to see the history of all the things you have copied so once that's done you want to access your clipboard manager through the windows key plus v so once you click on the windows key plus v you're going to have access to this clipboard manager so it shows you the history of all the things you have copied already like you can see there are a whole bunch of them that you have copied so if you want to access anything you can easily do that by just double clicking on it and it's going to paste whatever you have copied at that particular point so how you use this is that for example you might have the first information then you have a second information and why not a third information and so if you go ahead and copy the first information that's quite nice you can easily transfer it over here transfer it over here quite easily there's no problem up to that level now you copy the second information now you can equally transfer that here there's no problem but what if you wanted to have access to the first information will you have to go and copy it back again and be cycling through the, that copy and paste um, um, option no that won't be really good you will make you tired having to copy and paste all the time so what you do is that you can easily have access to your clipboard history and you just double click to paste the information then you go on and have again the clipboard manager you go ahead and paste whatever data whatever information you copied that really gives you access to everything easily and quite fast so you can go ahead and copy all of the theory pieces of information and is going to store it in that history quite easily so it's amazing it's nice i really enjoy it so um the clipboard manager on windows comes with a lot more features than just the clipboard history you have access to some couple of additional things so if you come here to this first option you have a list of emojis you have a list a list of gifs that you can easily just paste around you have equally cow emojis i think that's how i pronounce it and then some symbols as well so as you can see there's an arrow here that lets you see a lot more options yeah it's not just what was in front there so you have a lot more options you can paste currencies you can paste a lot more things than just that symbols supplemental symbols and so on and so forth so this clipboard manager has th those features you can go ahead and check out the emojis there, there's a whole bunch of emojis in there you can easily see and as you can see you have here the history of all the emojis you have already pasted recently you have um, a list of all the emojis you equally have some other forms of emojis you even have is have some unique emojis and so on and so forth it's really well packed with just the emojis and so that's just even for the first option going to the second option now you have um, i think yeah this is a special button for the emojis yeah then now coming to this other option is going to be the gifs the cow emojis so i believe this first option just has a whole collection of all of them but here are the buttons for each and every one of them so if you come here you have the symbols and all so this the clipboard manager of windows it really comes back with a lot of um, these features gifs emojis and all and it also stores your clipboard history so that you can easily access it if you want to clear all your clipboard history you can easily do that as well if you want to pin a, a a, a, a clip because it's a call clips whatever you copy is called a clip so if you want to pin a clip you can go ahead and press the three buttons on there you can go ahead and press three buttons on here then you press on a clip here so it's going to clip it there once it's filled it means it's clipped once it's unfilled it means it's not clipped so you can go ahead and do that so it's going to paste that equally as well if you click on it two times so that's how you can make use of the 
Windows clipboard history is it's just a small tool, but it's quite useful, especially when you have to do a lot of typing, a lot of reporting. You're going to be transferring data a lot. It really comes in handy. You should definitely check out this tool. I personally use another clipboard manager, which just, just has a lot more features. But Windows clipboard manager, is, I think it offers the basic features necessary for um so for the ordinary windows 11 user but definitely if you want something way more uh, way more professional or with more features check out my video on the Ditto clipboard manager so definitely i hope you enjoyed this tool i hope you enjoyed the video catch you on the next one